and hi friends a very good morning and welcome to my channel and it's a sunday oh <laughs> yeah the our topic of discussion today is microservice definitely and uh, the buzz word has been uh, quite uh, famous for this for a while and uh, you all of you are more or less you know all about uh, microservices and have some of you has definitely an uh, uh, industrial experience in microservice but for those who do not uh, know this one much and also who knows this uh, i have been preparing this video for both of them for all types of people all types of techie guys uh, well what is microservice as you all know microservice is nothing but a large service has been broken down into different small pieces and each of each of the pieces would be having its individual uh, responsibilities like an entire payment gateway an entire order system like amazon or flipkart while uh, there are uh, multiple application parts are there like uh, order like billing inventories are all but say one of the module gets uh, down then in their application in case of monolithic architectures or uh, services it would entirely fall the um, uh, entire service would be down and the people cannot utilize it further but in case of microservices that segregation has been done like payment billing inventory if one is down the other would operate and serve the purpose to the customers so just going through a basic brief of our session here what uh, we have implemented is a nothing but a gold cost uh, prediction app here from any third party this our first uh, microservice which is a gold rate application it will determine the rate and via one of its api it will expose it to the another application which will determine calculate the gold price application and uh, there would be a ui which would be exposed to the customer customer would be able to provide that uh, i am taking say 1000 grams of gold how much it would cost and also there are two types like 14 carat or 22 carat different depending on the types of gold that uh, the customer is trying to uh, get it would get uh, it would provide estimation well the ui part we haven't implemented yet but only uh, we are dealing with since we are trying to show the microservice uh, how microservice works we have only implemented these two microservice let's come to the code part here this is the product structure this is our product and this is the project actually project structure here is the gold rate app it will generate the random application uh, it's a random application which will generate an api and would and it would expose the cost of uh, the rate of the gold that it's going on you can see here that this is the main driver class Hmm, this is the rate controller you can see if any of the uh, if any of the request comes with the rate and it's a 22 carat or 14 depending upon the values then it was simply creating a random object it is creating an object of a gold rate dto class and it's uh, exposing the uh, this particular object okay and this response from this application is utilized by the gold price app and gold price app does what it's nothing but it consumes as you will be able to see here this is price controller this is a reader this rate reader would do nothing but it would read the api as you can see this is the api of the gold rate app along with along with the rate uh, parameter that has been passed and here you can find out that it's nothing but reading it reading the application and generating a new from the json uh, with the help of the json library we are uh, creating a gold rate object and here this is again exposing an api that's nothing but will take the amount of gold in grams and uh, the whatever uh, carrot the customer is trying to find out the price of say 12 carat 18 carat or 22 carat on the basis of that the prices will be returned to the customer so i have kept the application up let's go for a demo here would be like for the gold rate app i have kept it here this is the url say for 14 carat we are trying to find out the what what, what is the rate existing rate now see gold carat is 14 and the gold rate is this so in case a customer tries to find out the what what's the existing rate of uh, uh, 22 carat gold it would be like this the rate is say 5000 uh, per gram 
is the cost so in case what would be the second application do the second uh, microservice would find out the cost of say 14 karat we are using it's a uh, 14 karat gold so here the fourth price of 14 karat gold 2 gram is 5400 so if uh, we are trying to find out the price of 22 karat 2 grams as you can see the gold rate is 5000 if the amount is like 2 grams the, pr the price would be around 10000 so let us again try to change this one as 11 gram so 11 gram price was really 55000 precisely so in this way you can uh, try and implement a, a basic microservice application and also you can definitely uh, modify it further for the beneficial of your whatever type of use you want you're trying to do and you're trying to implement so this is the overall uh, structure of our project and i hope you like it once again for this time and there's a good news like all these videos whichever were there they have been aggregated into one of an important uh, website that I have made like this one uh, learn and explore with sap.xyz uh, it will take some time let it load meanwhile it loads yes it's loading uh, what I will uh, say is that this particular uh, tutorial site as uh, from the scratch I have developed with the help of some templates uh, HTML and CSS the, the as well as the front end entire designing has been done by me with the help this is nothing but designed with the help of spring boot as well as thymy leaf and here in the tutorial section this is the logo that I also have designed and uh, this is a brief one of, of my own and here like on the basis of the tutorial click you will find out like tutorials on spring boot dockers are all present if you click on the spring boot you will be able to find out all the tutorials that i have made so so far and this video will also be rendered into this one so hope you liked it hope you enjoyed it thank you for watching all the best